A CDC safety group says there's a likely association between RMNA and COVID-19 vaccines and a heart condition in young adults. This is based on recent data showing over 1,200 reports of post-vaccine heart inflammation. Here are the details. According to several members of the CDC's Vaccine Advisory Committee, there's a likely link between mRNA vaccines and heart inflammation in young adults. Among them is Dr. Matthew Oster, a pediatric cardiologist who told the panel that it does appear that the mRNA vaccines may be a trigger for myocarditis. Pediatrics professor Dr. Sarah Long also called the link highly likely. Members of the group noted the heart inflammation condition is rare. According to new CDC data, there are over 1,200 cases of post-vaccination heart inflammation. The data was published ahead of the CDC's advisory committee meeting. Most of the cases were male, and around 40% were people 29 years old or younger. And most of these reports dealt with myocarditis or pericarditis that were experienced after a second dose of a messenger RNA-based vaccine like Pfizer or Moderna's. Myocarditis is the inflammation of the middle layer of the heart muscle. Pericarditis is the inflammation of the sac around the heart. Of all the reports, 323 met CDC's case definitions for myocarditis and or pericarditis. 309 of the patients were hospitalized. Nine are still in the hospital with two in intensive care. According to the CDC, the case rate based on the reports is higher than expected in young males. Experts say the panel could end up recommending that certain age populations not get mRNA-based vaccines or that young adults only get one shot instead of two.